Hi, this is Trey Passer. Welcome to my review of Beast. This is the movie starring Edris Elba. Uh, he plays a divorced father who takes his two young daughters, teenage daughters, back to Africa to visit an old friend and also to the place where his uh, he met his wife and uh, his wife who's passed on and they were divorced. So he, there's some tension between him and his, particularly his older daughter, you know, because of the state of their, you know, their family. And, you know, he's he was a doctor and they, his wife and him, Got a divorce and then you know she got cancer and died and and he's trying to reconnect basically with his daughter by taking them back to where she grew up and stuff and he meets his friend there uh played by charlotte copley he plays his friend uh martin battles who's like a game warden and of course like i said this is a movie called beast so the beast in question is a rogue lion i guess who's gone rogue because there's these poachers there that hunt and basically they kill his whole pride except him. And then basically you got a, a lion, a rogue lion wanting revenge. <laughs> and uh, this movie is, you know, it's pretty standard thing. It's like I said, it's 92 minutes, so it doesn't drag out too long and stuff. It gets kind of right to the point of you know, this, you know, this father and his two young daughters, you know, and, you know, and their friend trying to survive this rogue lion who's, you know, just going, you know, <laughs> I was going to say ape S, but, I guess he's going lying, right? Uh, trying to, um, you know, you know, kill the poachers and kill any, basically any human in his path. And I, I liked it. It was a nice movie. Nice, like I said, it was full of a lot of tension, a lot of, you know, a lot of uh, on your edge moments in this movie and stuff. Waiting to see what happened. And the CGI was, I think, was pretty good with the lion and stuff. And uh, it was intense. And uh, you know, it's it's a typical movie. Like I said, <laughs> you have people doing incredibly stupid stuff <laughs> at certain points in the movie and stuff. And Edris Elba is a solid lead in this picture, you know, trying to hold it together for his daughters and, and to, you know, try to survive and stuff. And, and, you know, like I said, there's that tension between him as particularly his older, you know, their older daughter, they have that resentment because their family was, you know, s split up and stuff, but it's a, a re really good movie. And I think I like the young actresses that played his daughter. I think there was really good. And of course, Charlotte Copley, like I said, he's the friend, the game warden there that's with them during this uh, escapade. He's really good, a good solid uh, co-star. And again, like I said, this, a lot of intense moments in this movie. And I got, like I said, it's 92 minutes, so it's not, it doesn't drag out, okay? It gets kind of right to the point. And uh, it was good, I liked it. It was, you know, it's a nice uh, film. And I would give it a uh, seven out of 10, because again, like I said, it's, it's kind of, you know, it's kind of what you expect from these type of, types of movie and stuff, and it, and it gives it to you. And Edward Elba gives a really good, solid performance. And again, I like the two young actresses that play his daughter. They were, you know, they were really, particularly, really good. And you, you know, you're invested in trying to, in hoping that they survive, and stuff. And I think, yeah, Charlotte Copley was really good too, as well. So again, I'll give it a seven out of ten, and definitely recommend. You know, if you want to see these type of films, you know, they are what they are. They're entertaining. They're brief and they're quick, and they get to the point. This, that's what this movie does. Okay, you don't go into the movies hoping for some deep psychological. Uh, reason and stuff you know and you know things don't happen the way they happen in this movie in, in real life but you kind of go with it because this is the movie that it is so anyway let me know what you think of beast if you've seen it what do you think of it feel free to leave comments down below i have links to my social media in the description box facebook twitter and instagram also have a link to my other channel for views and opinions if you check that out as well also have a link down below to my patron and i want to say a special thank you to my patron his name will appear on this video somewhere i want to say thank you to him for supporting me I always have my back and again my patrons only five dollars a month have tons of content on there, tons of unedited content on uh, unedited TV show reactions on there. Everything from WandaVision to Loki to Hawkeye to Moon Knight to What If uh, to She-Hulk is going to be on there pretty soon. I'm going to put that on there. Uh, 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 Holly Quinn, the animated show, season three is going to be there. Also, uh, Titans, Doom Patrol, uh, Superman and Lois, Stargirl, uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi, The Book of Boba Fett, all four parts of Zack Snyder's Just League. Follow the link below to the Patreon. Check it out. Also, please give this video a thumbs up. It helps the channel, and I truly appreciate it. Also, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, so you know when I upload new content to this channel. And this is Trey Pastor saying so long, and take care.